welcome to Kitsa. I have some exciting news for you guys. But before I tell the, you the news, I first want to ask you a question. Have you ever received exciting news? What do you do? Do you keep it to yourself or do you share it with other people? No, we share it with other people. So what can be like exciting news? Uh, maybe getting a new pet, a puppy or a chicken or a kitten or getting a new baby brother or sister. What about a good grade in school? We share exciting news with other people. And what are some ways we can share it? So in the old days, people would walk around and they would like shout it out or they would ring a bell. Um, nowadays, people will put it on Facebook or social media or the internet if there's exciting news. If God has exciting news, He has messengers that he uses. He uses prophets, but God also uses angels. Remember last week, God used angels to share the good news with the shepherds. Today, God sent, in our story today, God sent the angel Gabriel to Mary to share some exciting news with her. So I think maybe if you see an angel, that could be a little bit scary in the beginning, but he is a special messenger from God, so we need to listen up. So um, our memory verse is from John 3 verse 16, and it says, For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whoever believes in Him will not die but live forever. So study that verse so that you can keep it in your hearts and remember that if you give your heart to Jesus, you will live with Him forever one day. So keep on listening. Bronwyn has some news for you guys and Josh. We love you guys and we miss you. Hi KidZone and welcome to the season of Advent. You'll find all kinds of Advent resources at ucub.com and on our KidZone page. Also our encouragement team is going to be out and about dropping off some things at your houses um, to encourage you to participate in this Advent season alongside us. Something else coming up in December, coming up on December 6th, which is today if you're watching on Sunday, at 2 p.m. is our next Worship Together event. It'll be at 2 o'clock to 2.45 right outside on the UCC lawn. We'd love for you to come with your family with blankets or uh, folding chairs and your masks and come hang out with us and worship together. The next thing is going to be a very special event coming up on Friday, December 18th at 6.30 p.m. We're going to have a Christmas movie Zoom watch party, 6.30 p.m., followed by a Kahoot. You're not going to miss it, so make sure to tell your parents, tell your siblings, and mark that on the calendar, Friday, December 18th at 6.30 p.m. We'll have more information about that coming up pretty soon. And another thing we have more information on is our drive-in Christmas services on Christmas Eve, December 24th. They'll be in our parking lot at UCC. The first one will be at 4.30 p.m. And finally, we know this season, as this pandemic rolls on and on and stretches out and out, some families are definitely impacted in certain ways. If your family or a family you know of is in need of resources, please visit the KidZone webpage, KidZone online backslash, sorry, forward slash resources. We have all kinds of information there on local resources, such as the Yolo County Food Bank, steak, and much more. Thanks so much. Bye. Hey Glacier, Josh here. It was awesome seeing you guys last weekend on Zoom. This weekend we have a Sunday morning Bible video you guys can check out. And next weekend is going to be our next Glacier in-person event, which is going to be Sunday, December 13th. We are looking forward to seeing you guys then. See you later.